Insert magical teleportation sounds here. It's time to use the new Slayer Master Chandelier going forward and to see what kind of tasks we got and get more points. I'm finally able to take advantage of this and I'm looking forward to it. Looking forward to what kind of tasks that she's able to give me. So cave crawlers, that's that's just annoying to travel to. That's I'm excited. So cave crawlers ain't quite something that you write home about. They're not fun, it's not exciting, they don't have any drops that are of note. The one thing to mention of it though is that it's in the Fremenic Slayer dungeon. The thing is with this dungeon is that we're going to be going there quite often. The best teleport that I have right now would be to teleport to Camelot and run all the way up north. If I don't bring energy potions with me then each time it's going to be quite a lot of walking. So we need to solve this and the best way that I can come up with is to make my house in Relica. The only problem with that is that I didn't realize you need 30 construction to move your house there. I guess it's time now to work on construction. Getting one third of the way to 99 construction, we stop at 30. It was very quick, very fast, and we're now ready to move our house over to Relica. Alright, our next Slayer task has actually brought a little bit of a problem. The task is Blue Dragons. These are found in the Taverly Dungeon. The thing is with the Blue Dragons is that you can run around the entire dungeon to get the Dusty Key and go through the door that direction. However, there's another path for agility that requires 70 agility to get through, and you squeeze through a pipe. This is a path that immediately brings you to the blue dragons after going down the ladder. I think it's time for us to get 70 agility. You know, it's really great that I decided before doing my Slayer task to get my agility up to 70. Because now I can know that the true pain in life is doing agility at all. I don't know how people do it, how people get to 99. This is, I, I started at like 61 and we're not even to 70 quite yet, but we're about to hit 70 and it, it's misery, dude. I'm not even excited over this. Oh, we got 70. That's awesome. All right, here we are back at Taverly Dungeon. Just got to go down this ladder and squeeze through that pipe. It, don't get me wrong, getting the agility up is something we're going to have to do anyways at some point or another, so it's nice to have it for now to get through this pipe. However, it's not its not as rewarding after you spend so many hours getting a skill up just to do one task. Since we're on the idea of working on getting quick travel to different places like the agility for 70, I figure now it's time to work on getting all the teleports done. The first one being the Trollheim teleport. For this we have to do Troll Stronghold and we gotta do Edgar's Ruse. Now these are pretty simple tasks, but I hate trolls. Anyways, it's time to get on with Troll Stronghold. We gotta make our way around the mountain with our climbing boots, so that means we have to kill a chicken first. Fun fact, mountain goats love to climb. Not only do they love to climb, but they can jump up to 12 feet in one leap. It's been a long time since my dad has seen me. He doesn't even recognize my face anymore. Once I got through the gates, he immediately went on full offense and wants to fight me. I almost feel bad because my dad is so stupid he can't even make it to me. However, part of me wonders, what does it mean? Was he the Itachi to my Sasuke? Did he want me to overcome difficulties by taking him on? What does it all mean? Alright, we found the stronghold. Let's go inside now. I may or may not have gotten a little bit confused as to where I was supposed to go. I will plead the fifth on that one. Alright, so I'm gonna be real. I did look a quest guide up because I got confused as to where to go. I know. Okay, listen, it's embarrassing. However, part of the quest guide was like, 
all right, this is how you safe spot these guys up here. And me, I looked at them, I'm like, I can just face tank them. What is the problem? I cannot face tank them, okay? I, I almost died. My whole life flashed before my... That was an awful experience that I wish nobody has to deal with. Just safe spot them. If a guy says to do something, just do it. Don't try to think that you're smarter than him. All right, we killed the general and we got the key. Um, that was a roller coaster of emotions. Next part is super easy. We just have to kill these two guys and let out the other two prisoners. Don't mention it, Edgar. Don't even worry about it. We're not friends and I only did this so I can get Edgar for the next quest, but you're welcome, bud. Now get out of here. Troll stronghold completed. So I kind of did it again where I do that thing of not looking at requirements ahead of time, but this one's kind of simple. It's just I needed to get some herb lore levels. We have a lot of energy restore potions now, and although I've never really used them in the past, hopefully I can remember to use these ones. Time to start Edgar's Bruise. I'll do it for you. We're going back up the mountain, which means we have to kill another chicken. Ignore the fact that I did not one-shot them. Let me just climb up these rocks, and these ones, and these ones. We're at Edgar's ugly place. He didn't seem excited to help us, however, he heard sound for you, and then all of a sudden his demeanor changed, and he wants to help us. First things first, we need to get gout weed. To get gout weed, we need to get it from burnt meat. The only way that we get it from him is if we give him a tasty human. Luckily, Edgar's got a plan. You could almost say it's a ruse. Step one is that we need to steal a parrot. Only way to do that is to make it drunk. Unfortunately, this guy does not want us to take the parrot, so we'll bring it to the vet. Well, at least that's what we tell him. You're very welcome, Pete. Kill a chicken? Hide the parrot so it learns humanese? Now you gotta get that dirty, nasty, disgusting clothes from this man. Kill a chicken? Now we just gotta hand everything in to Edgar and let him do his magic. All we gotta do is grind up some of that weed and put it into a drink. Now we just gotta get that drunk parrot back which can now speak full humanese. Kinda. Slap the parrot in a mannequin. In the most humane way possible, we're going to give the parrot human to the troll so that he can eat it. Just gotta steal this key from the cupboard. The key is needed to get into the storeroom where the gout weed is. It has guards kind of walking around, so it's kind of like a Sly Cooper type, uh, you know, robbery, if you will. So it's super easy. Just go in, grab the gout weed, and you're out. Return back to Sandview with the gout weed. And we've completed Edgar's ruse. Now we're able to use the Trollheim teleport. Now begs the question, what are you going to use the Trollheim teleport for? I don't know. So piggybacking on unlocking Trollheim teleport from Edgar's ruse, I think what I should do is just unlock as many transportation options as I can in the game that are from quests, obviously. Uh, just so that I can get them out of the way now and don't have to deal with them down the road. So we've got Plague City, which I can do right now. Enlightened Journey I can do right now. Fairy Tales Part 1 and 2, I'm gonna need some Herb and Farm up. Ghosts of Hoy we can do now. Watchtower we can do. Another Slice of Ham and A Taste of Hope. Both are gonna require a couple quests prior. I gotta check what my stats are to the quests themselves I'm unsure of like if I can do them yet but either way we still have Shiloh Village and Eagle's Peak which I can do and we finished Corsair Curse already so I would like to get through all of those and just have as many of those transportations unlocked as possible I'm still a little salty over the elder robes for magic kind of just dying because of the defense I got up but it is what it is. I guess now I can have some cheap mystic gear and be a pleb. Either way, that's going to be it for this update. Thanks for checking it out. And until next time.